Mike Riley, college football's Mr. Nice Guy, rarely appears worried about, well, anything. Injuries, results, the state of the program. Most often, the 64-year-old gives off the impression he's just happy to be along for the ride. That aw shucks demeanor is justified this season as Nebraska prepares to play a near average strength of schedule. The website cfbanalytics.com has a predictive metric that takes into account points scored and allowed to generate a team's expected winning percentage against an average team. Using that data, the site has created a total strength of schedule calculation that pegs Nebraska as having the 54th toughest schedule out of 128 FBS programs, 12 spots lower or easier than it was last season, and one spot easier than Riley's first season in Lincoln. ESPN's Football Power Index has calculated the probability of the Cornhuskers winning every game on the schedule. Based on 10,000 simulations of the 2017 season, Nebraska has a 0% chance of winning out and a 0.1% chance of winning the Big Ten Conference. Not great. However, Nebraska's non-conference schedule is about what you would think, with the Huskers given an 83.9% chance of beating Arkansas State, a 19.7% chance of beating Oregon, and an 88.2% chance of beating Northern Illinois. If you add it up, the Cornhuskers have a 26.1% chance of finishing the non-conference slate undefeated, something the team has accomplished three times since joining the Big Ten. As for the conference schedule, home tilts with Wisconsin and Ohio State and road contests against Minnesota and Penn State might not sound easy, but according to the numbers, Nebraska's schedule is easier than the Big Ten conference average. Draw the curtain back further and the 2017 schedule is more manageable than what the program has been through since 2008. So while Mike Riley's standard disposition appears positive, there's a reason the old ball coach is smiling these days. That's Big Red Zone by the Numbers. Josh Planos, KETV Newswatch 7.